Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine has passed a critical milestone in the fight to curb the spread of coronavirus. Good evening, I'm Kimberly Hunt. And I'm Steve Atkinson. Lindsay Pena has the night off tonight. This afternoon, a panel recommended the FDA authorize the vaccine. As our ABC 10 News reporter Jennifer Dela Cruz explains, the next challenge is getting it to those who need it most. The vaccination of a lifetime is just days away for San Diego hospitals. Sharp Healthcare is getting ready to distribute thousands of Pfizer vaccines to their frontline employees. They will sign up and be scheduled, so it won't be, uh, we don't want people lining up at the door. We, we want to make sure we're maintaining social distancing. Suzanne Shea is the vice president of pharmacy services for Sharp. She says their freezer will store the doses at the necessary negative 80 degrees centigrade. From there, they'll be moved to refrigerators when they're ready to be given out. The vaccine won't be mandatory for their staff, but it will be available at all of their locations to make it as convenient as possible. Frontline workers like Edsel Montemayor are at the top of the list to get the vaccine. He's a physical therapist working with COVID patients who've been hospitalized. We're right in front of them, standing them up, you know, face to face. And, you know, um, the first inclination is to want them to wear a mask so that they're not, you know, coughing onto you and whatnot. But their oxygen saturations are so low that you almost just feel bad for asking them to do so. He sees the long term effects COVID can have on the body. He says some people can't even get out of bed. Others have lasting symptoms resembling a stroke. Well, I've seen a lot of people where they're not going to return to normal life. It takes a village to help these folks and the nurses are overwhelmed and so it's all hands on deck. The challenge now for many healthcare workers is dispelling myths about vaccines. They're hoping that by their example, others will follow. Are you going to be getting the vaccine? Absolutely. That needle is going to go in my arm. Sharp Healthcare says even people who've already had COVID-19 should be vaccinated. Jennifer Dela Cruz, ABC 10 News. And San Diego County is set to receive 28,000 doses of the vaccine for the initial shipment. Another round of vaccines is expected to come in about three to four weeks.